Now we have prepared a SSD of ASLID AS2258. Essentially, AS2258 belongs to Fisun PS3111 controller. When we are unsure of the real controller ID, we need to seek short pins, which often records ROM characters. When SSD can get ready compared to wrong short pins, current short pins generally are correct. Enter random utility and confirm the real controller ID. Then we will know the real controller. As for AS2258 controller we should choose Qmo A solid, Fison, utility. Firstly, program will send commands to initialize ID info. After initialization we load loader. From our test version M71.2 can gain higher success rate. If it fails, reset power and respectively test the versions till it succeeds. After successful uploading, exit and enter utility again. Due to LDR data present in RAM. The purpose of last step is to obtain capacity and more firmware info. So the second initialization process will take longer time. Note, the key to creating translator is to ensure the success of the last two items. When stop button becomes gray, indicating the end of initialization. Click on create translator. Note, AS2258 PS3111 SSDs often encounters two typical translator malfunctions. When SSD can get ready status, generally we can obtain capacity. Then we directly create translator. When SSD can't get ready status, we need keep shorting pins like using a wire. Then upload loader to obtain necessary info, including CapKD. The most of AS2258 cases belong to the latter one. The marked part indicates bad blocks in flash NAND. They easily appear in areas usually accessed. When parition table is corrupted, need to image entire drive, scan for files. After virtual translator is created, we return to the main interface. Enter DE module to create a data copy task. In the settings, choose factory reading mode on command to read page. Disable soft reset in error handling and timeout settings. Because some SSDs may encounter delayed feedback, leading to long busy issue. It is recommended to skip 8 sectors here. Go to file explorer to check if the file tree can be accessed. Then start the imaging process. If file tree cannot be expanded, it is recommended to choose VHDX as target device. Then use tools like RSTUDIO to scan for files.